courses aren't a nine to five job. It's a eight day a week job, 24 hours. But it's really rewarding, especially if you know, you've, you've got a horse from nothing and you take it through the success and, and through the races to a top level. Uh, it, it's very much rewarding because you know what's gone into that horse to get it there. you realise as a jockey that it takes a lot to get a horse there for that minute or minute and a half. It's not just about that, that, that minute of a race. There's a lot that goes into it before you get there. From the, the training side of it, to the race planning, to keeping them sound, to keeping them healthy, and then to get them there on the day. Most days I ride out because you don't just see the horse canter past you, you can see the traits of them all around and you can get a feel of them yourself. Um, once a week I'll sit on, stand on the ground and watch them work or, or watch them canter past just to see what I think of them, but enjoy riding out. As a jockey, I know when I'm sitting on and, and I, I know if a horse is ready or, or I could tell myself a little bit about them of what trip it wants or temperament wise or ground to help race plan to get it right. Every horse is an individual because they all have their different traits. It's like humans. We're not all the same. So how can horses be the same? Every horse has a personality and it's about finding out what that is. The horse comes first, what they need and how they need to be trained they get. To me that, that makes a massive difference. The owner has, definitely has an opportunity to be more involved because of that personal touch, of that smaller scale. And we want you to make, be part of the team. It's a friendly, small team. You can welcome any time to come and see your horses. You get regular video updates and it's not so much of a formality. It's more of an informal relationship. You're going to hope to bring the best result out and keeping the owner happy. Of course it goes and gets sold for such amount and the owner might reinvest that whole amount back into another horse and that might be the next champion. You're working together as a team to get there. You're, you're striving to always want more. You're striving to get the best results and striving for success, striving for the bigger results and, and testing yourself, testing yourself, testing the team and sometimes testing the horses. Newmarket produces great facilities. You don't need to worry if it's frozen, if it's raining or if it's too dry. The gallops are there to use the whole time. We've got everything we need here. The vets are on call, the farriers, everything's sort of a stone's throw away and, and that's what makes life easier and a little bit more um, cost effective. I think it's very important to show your willingness to go abroad also, to show that you are striving for more the whole time. You know, we've been fortunate enough to go to France, Ireland, Bahrain, been to Dubai, to America. You're hungry for success, you're hungry to get your name out there, you're hungry to go abroad. By going abroad, you're coming out of your comfort zone. And that's, that's what you've got to keep pushing yourself to do.